Hello, hello. This is Pat with Petresca Papers. I'm out in the Bluebird Bungalow and I want to play more with little bits of lace. And that is connecting with the hashtag little bits of lace 2024 challenge from Tracy Fox. So far, I have done, let's see, how, where did we start? With the hidden paper clip with the freebie calendars that she had. And also with the journal card that I did some, a ruffle and some lace. And it's clipped into the latest, which was adding lace to the larger houses in my Home Sweet Homes Little Lace Houses digital kit. I'll link that below. And then this was the first little house. And it comes with three options of little houses. And this is the one I have done so far. Well, as I was thinking about what I need or what I want, I, my mind just gravitates back to hidden paper clips. And I, I kind of did a, a search to see if there are people who've been doing hidden paper clips that have lace. And I, I really couldn't find any. Now, I didn't do an extensive search. But that's what I want is some cute little lace hidden paper clips. So I have pulled my little bits of lace and trim and fabric that I've been using. You know, I have so much more than this, but I'm limiting myself. Got some paper clips, just small ones. I do have some large ones off to the side if I want to use those. I've got some twine or jute. I'm not sure that I'll use this. I've got some 3-in-1 or Fabri-Tac. It's a little bit thicker that might help hold on to glue. I do have my, my, uh, what is this? Oh, I'm having a moment. My Art Glitter Glue, I've got it with a tiny, tiny tip, and then this one has a little bit bigger tip. And I pulled this little container with some antique, I think they're made from oyster shell buttons. Okay. And some offcuts from different different things that I've I've been working on. So the first thing that I need to do is make the base to put the lace on. So I am going to get my trimmer out and hopefully not knock everything all over the place. And I think that my optimum, I think, I think I'm going to go an inch and a, I'm going to go an inch and three quarters because I can always cut it down. Are you straight? Okay. And I think, let's see, I think you are too, too short. So I'll cut one of these and I'll do that one, this one a little thinner. I'll do this one inch and a half. And then I've got, what else did I have here? some of this but it's oh it's so pretty but it is not on anything thick enough that I could put it on something we'll see we'll see we'll see for now we'll start with these two and 
We'll just set this aside just in case we need it. All right. Now let's get scissors and let's trim off this and trim off that. Not that it's going to matter because those ends will be folded up in. So I am going to take, oh, and these, that's what it is. These are my calendars. Well, I didn't ruin them. And look down here. I've got some that's not calendars. I am not going to be wasteful. Shock of all shocks. So let's do this. And whatever width this is, that's what we'll work with. Okay, and I do need to take off this little white edge here. Okay, come on, don't be stubborn. There we go. And this time I'll leave the white on because that gives us a little bit more to work with. Maybe... Maybe we will use a big clip if we can. Let me get one out of here. All right, so let's fold. Let's fold. I do want it right there. Okay, so we'll fold there. And we'll fold that like that and then we're going to fold someone was saying that they like it when the two folds down here are not even it's easier to put on and off the page and i agree okay so this will fold up like that and we'll just trim that off about where do we want it about like that so that it can it'll slide up on itself yeah that'll be good all right and oh look that's that's a double sided okay all right now Take the clip off for a moment and do some distressing on these little white edges around here. And again, I'm using the Ground Espresso. Es espresso? I don't think it's Espresso. Espresso. All right. Just like that. We'll do some on there, some on there, and some on there and do I want to work on the lace well it's on the clip I don't think so so we know we want lace here and here but not those two okay so what are we going to do? Let's pull out the lace. And, oh, that's so pretty. Ooh, I think that I would like that. I think I would like that. And I don't want to cut it. Oh, so which way is right and wrong? I don't know. I don't know. Probably doesn't matter. I think this is right. All right, so here we go. And I'm going to try this fabric tack. And I'm going to put it kind of along where there's more solid parts of this lace. And right along that. I kind of want these little uh, lace, these little balls there to kind of 
hang over. So I don't want to put glue on them. Okay. So, hope everybody is good. It is a nice day here in Georgia, but tomorrow does not bode well for us. It looks like we've got the warmth of today that's going to hit the cold from the east and cause havoc. And it was interesting, it was last year to the day that a little town south of us, Griffin, had a tornado and lots of people we know were affected adversely by that. Uh, one being the Hobby Lobby that was in Griffin. Very sad. And a friend whose home was affected just barely has gotten back into her home. I'm sure she's a bit frightened about what this could mean again for them. And I am a bit frightened. I'm looking for something, some of my, there's some right here I can use. This is that wax, waxy paper that I pull off of my double-sided tape. All right. So that will be like that and like that. All right. So we need a few more things that are contrasting. I kind of like that. Okay, we can put that there. Do I still have this? I have I have a little flower still. There's one. I think I will. I'll just trim that tool off. I'm around it. I probably could leave it on. It's pretty. But let's see. I'll use that on another one. So that can go in there. Like that on one side. Do we want to make the other side the same? I think not necessarily. Let's see. What have I got? That's a contrast. I have some of this cheesecloth. I think that would be interesting. Do some fraying on it. Is that too big? No, not really. And then, what about? You're so nice and big. I think I'm going to hold on to you. I don't want to cut you in half. What else do I have? I have this little piece. That might work. Let's trim off that and that and that. Since it, it'll be seen from two sides, so you might, I might as well make it two-sided. Be cute. No, I don't want to cut you up. I don't want to. What about, let's do one of these. Let's do this one right here. Right. Like that. Let's cut this off. And then, thinking a button on that one. Oh, look at that cute rectangle button. No. Oval? But you are not enough contrast there. Look at that cute heart. Kind of a tortoise shell, I think. And that's it. All right. 
And I think that I'm going to try to put this jute is pretty fine. I'm going to try. Oh, it's, it's such a mess. I'm going to try to. Oh, I see. That's the rough side of the shell. That's the pretty side. Ugh. We're going to go with the rough. We're going to go with the rough because it's a much nicer contrast. All right, there we go. Okay. I came out to my shed and out to the Bluebird Bungalow and it was cold out here. I guess that means my insulation is working because it was it hadn't warmed up to the 60 degrees it is outside. So I guess that's a good thing. Oh, come on. Come on. You can tie a bow. Might be easier to tie it after and get it stuck down. But we're going to try one more time. There we go. Yes? No? Nope. We're going to do it when we get it stuck on. All right. So let's glue this down with, where are you? Right here. How fun would it be to write a nice note to a good friend and attach one of these little lace, little lace hidden paper clips to the letter? Because, the, you know, even if they don't junk journal, they can put it on a calendar, on a piece of important paper if they work. Okay, you're there. Good. And just a bit on you. Come on. You haven't been out here to get cold. You've been in the house all nice and warm. Okay, there's that. And I think I'm going to turn you around. I'm only putting, I think I'm just going to put a glob of that right there and stick that down. It's sticking to my fingers. Okay. And let's see. Ooh, there's not much on you. And you know what I think I'll do? I'm going to grab some of that. Where is it? I know I didn't use it all. The music paper. All right. So, again, this is that very, very, very tender and delicate Okay, so you'll see a little blip. My husband had to come in to ask me an all-important question. All right, so I think that, and I'm going to do some stressing along there. So it'll show up a little more. Okay, let's glue this down. And this may help hold everything in place on this side. Let's go that way. Okay, that. And what did I have next? That little piece? Yeah, we'll still do that. With some, just on those flowers. that and then we're gonna you know I don't know do I need this one how much of that's gonna show with the button not much so I think something else I'm gonna put the button right on there okay except it doesn't want to let go now come on all right 
Now, this is concave, concave, convex, whatever. It's got a curve. So it's, it's going to need a good glob. In fact, it'd probably do good with a with glue gun. And I should have brought my glue gun out. My husband gave me a brand new glue gun that warms up really quick. It's got a battery, so it's cordless and it warms up very quickly. And I haven't really used it yet. Okay, I think I'm not going to play with you yet. I'm just going to set this aside and let it dry. And let's do, which is the other one? This one? Let's do this one. All right. So I am going to fold this in half. And fold that up. And is this going to be another big one? Yeah, that can be a big one. And we will fold it not quite all the way again. All right, and we'll turn that off. We can use that on something else. Let's see, and that will just. Oh, no, 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 I did it wrong. I cut it wrong. I needed this on there to tuck under. Well, what can we do? Can we fix it? I think we can fix it. I think that I'm going to fold this and let's use, let's see, are you warm enough to be used? You're pretty cold. We're going to let you warm up a bit. Let's see if this one will work. Yeah, there we go. And we will glue that on right there. Yes, yes, and then that yeah, that works. Okay, so let's trim that off just a hair there and let's get a little distress ink going on there and there down these sides and that. All right, so we're going big paper clips today. All right, so what should we do with you? I would love to do a little bit of that same fabric. What have I got? Yeah, let's do that. Can I tear it? Nope, not enough to tear, but I can. And pull some threads and I'm and fray it just a little bit. Let's do that. I'm wondering if I want lace under it. What about that? It doesn't show up much. Oh, what about this? That. Yeah, I like that. So let's cut right there just like that I think I'm gonna leave that on there but I'm not gonna glue it down right now and then this will go on there and what else oh 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 what have I got this can I use that it's a little long think. Oh, this. We'll use some of that right there. And 
what about where did that little those little white that I didn't want to keep on trying to follow me these little things where did it go where 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 oh. <laughs> everything likes to stick to each other look at that oh there they are there they are I think yeah I think we'll do that on there let's get that stuck down I think I'm gonna try just this has got a really thin netting on it and I think I can just put some of this art glitter glue on everything I'm going to have it. Is this where this is going to hang be longer? Yeah. I'm let it hang down below. Okay. And off to the side a little. Okay. And this little piece of fabric. I don't think I'm gonna going to try to do the whole piece on it. Put it on at a little bit of an angle. And this one I'm coming across here. That and I think I'll use the fabric tack on this one. Which way is right? I think that other one is the other side is because it's shinier. Okay. And down. I've got some some little stringies. Ah, my fingers too. Okay, I've just got to be careful. It's not very dry. And on this side, I think I will do another piece of music paper there. I should plan it out. Music paper. And what else? What else? What else? Maybe some of that green. Oh, this one? I'm not feeling that. I am not feeling it. Good if I could get my. Oh, look. Look, look, look. Got that pretty pink. There, like that. And another little piece of something and a button. What about you? That, and let's see. do that one I think that one, oh, I don't know if it's actually got a green hue to it I think it does okay all right let's get some glue on all of this and let's glue down oh let's get a little distressing going on here Sorry, you're seeing my arm up close. All right. Let's get that 
down. Oh, 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 I think I'm going to let this little tool from the other side come down on top of there. And then let's put this cute, I think this is from one of the windows that I tore for the little lace house. Add your own little bits of lace. Okay, and I think I want this to be a little smaller. Like that. Look at that. Oh, go back, go back. Like that. And let's find a little bit of this jute again. This time we're going to put the pretty kind of mother of pearl side up. I'm not even going to. I'm not even going to try to tie it. I just know that I will make a mess. Okay, so this will go like that. All right. Stay, don't stick to me. All right, that's gonna sit there. Let's bring this back. Let's finish tying this bow. Fingernails have glue on them. All right, let's pull this one and that and that, and then just give a little gentle tug to those rabbit ears. All right, let's add our paper clip. So, which side? I think it's this side. So I'm going to put the short side out. Okay. And that, yeah, that works. All right, so now I'm going to put, I'm going to try something. I saw someone do tape. No, 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 no. Don't change what you've already started doing. So, got glue on this one. We're going to fold it down onto itself. And I have to be gentle because I have the lace on the other side. I'm not sure how dry everything is. And now, this, I'm going to bring it down here. And there, I think, maybe just a smidge along that top. And that just slides up under itself. I need to squeeze it. Squeeze it. And I think, for good measure, while I'm waiting, and doing the other one, I'm just going to put some clips on this and a clothespin on there. Okay, let's just let that sit and let's do this one. Need to get a paper clip and let's see, are you dry enough? Let's find out. Want to pull it off? I do. I do. I hope I'm in screen. Okay, and then holding down that button while I pull it back. I need to be a little shorter. All right, that's good. 
Okay, so here we go. Let's bring this up. Which one's the longer? I think it's this this one right here. So I want to go this way. So here. This is that side that I mended. Okay, and yeah, it just still folds. So I'm giving it a nice glue there on itself. And then this one, I glue down the two sides. So again, this these were strips of paper cut across so about eight and a half inches. And that works really good to have the big paper clips in it. Okay, come on. You can do it. Come on. Have to kind of coax it. Okay, there we go. And I'm going to squeeze. And let's grab these clips off. And close pins and let you have some pressure. And let's look at this one. Oh, cute. All right. So here is my lace book. And let's let's replace this calendar with this. Okay, let's go from this side where we can see easily where it needs to come down. Oh my gosh, that's cute. And so the back side, you end up with a cute clip on the back of that also. All right, and let's put this one in here. And we're gonna put this calendar and I see it's, it gets, you have to kind of look for that since it's longer in the front and not the back. Okay, come on. There we go. Got that in there. And let's put this one. Okay, and so here's the longer. And let's do just like that. Okay, am I in the right spot? Yes, I am. It's trying to go underneath the lace. Okay, why are you being so hard? Let's try it on something else first. Did I glue something down? I did. I got glue. There we go. That's why. When I folded it over, I didn't fold it nice and straight. There we go. Cute. Okay, so let's we'll just use that card and put that in the journal. So we're just going to push that down, and I think we'll just slide you right up there. Oh, that looks very cute. All right, you guys. I'll have some links below for the two videos for the Little Lace Houses. I will also link... The hashtag little bits of lace 24 by Tracy Fox. And you can see all of the other little bits of lace projects people have done. Again, if you are one of my subscribers, thank you, thank you. And if this is your first time here, I hope you'll consider consider subscribing, leaving me a comment, ring the bell, come back and see what I'm I'm doing next out in the Bluebird Bungalow. Thank you so much. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.